Hello! Hey guys, and welcome back to The Eclectic Educator. I have been gone for some time. I just posted tonight a video that I recorded back at the beginning of May. And, um, <laughs> of the teacher's crate for April that came late. Well, I did get the teacher's crate in for May. But, before I unveil that one, I want to go ahead and show you the teacher's crate for March. I know that it is a month late, two months late actually, but I did record a video and I said I was going to post it on here, but it is my absolute favorite teacher's crate ever. And the very first thing I want to show you is the shirt that I have worn a gazillion times. It says, happy is a state of mind. This shirt could not have come at the most more appropriate time. State testing had begun, um, end of the year closeout had begun, all these things, the final nine weeks, all these things going on, and teachers get so stressed out. And so um, our principal had just given a speech on how to, at our faculty meeting, the day before this came. And, um, I wanted to wear it to school so badly that Friday, but I didn't do it because <laughs> I just thought it'd be really weird that he just gave a speech and then I wore this shirt saying happy is a state of mind. And that's exactly what our principal is trying to tell us, that we've got to stay strong, we've got to stay happy, we're going to make it, that this too shall pass. Um, it's really a hectic year, and those of you that aren't teachers, you don't understand. You just don't understand what it's like to be a teacher at the end of the school year. At the beginning and the end, those are the most stressful times for educators. Alright, so that's the t-shirt that came in the box. The next thing, I'm going to open this sucker up. They continued on with the confetti thing. And they put in these binder clips. I love binder clips. I'm losing them. I'm giving them away with stacks of papers, with copies. Um, I, I use binder clips for everything. And medium size is the perfect size. I absolutely adore these. So I think I'm going to be holding on to these and not letting these go. And I'll give away the black ones. But I'll keep these. Um, these are just adorable. I can use those for so many things. Okay, so the next thing that I absolutely love that was just perfect for back for state testing time were these confetti positive sayings and it's um, it is the confetti thing and and at the end of the school year um, kids and teachers they're, they're having these things these thoughts can I make it can I make it I'm not doing a great job I don't want to be here anymore just all kinds of things running through people's heads so these positive sayings and these can be used all year long it says let's do this you've got this sparkle every day never give up make it happen stay positive today is your day dream big believe in yourself and make today great so not only are these great for students but they're great for teachers too love those love 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 those I think that I might post these in my um I might post these in my classroom for all year. I might just go with this confetti theme. I don't know. I'm loving it right now. Okay, so one of the things that I do like, I get so excited about when the teacher's crate comes and they have a pair of John's socks in them. I, I just absolutely love pattern socks. And my coworkers, they laugh at me because I'll be wearing dress slacks <laughs> and maybe like a... a a jacket or a blazer or a cardigan and I'll have a pair of John socks on or some other kind of pattern sock and they think it's funny because when I sit down and you know how your leg raises your pant leg raises well they think it's funny anyway these are pink with monarch butterflies how adorable is that okay so the next thing is an Uli product in every box it has some kind of Uli product in April they had um, in April they had these post-it notes in this little dispenser kind of like the highlighter tape comes in but these this month for March they, um, they had colored pencils with 
erasers. And these are going to be fantastic in my back to school VIP box for my VIP table. All right, so the next thing, the last thing they have, um, the February box had the turquoise dots. And I have a lot of things, decorative things that go with that. Um, this one has the black and white, the BW collection for its black and white with just a little pop of color. And these are little decorative jumbo design cutouts. And these are the ones that are enclosed in the package. And these are fantastic. I'm going to put these away because I'm not going to do a theme like this next year. And um, but I do like them, so I'm going to keep them. I may do it the following year. It really just depends. This doesn't look like a very kindergarten theme, so it really depends if I get moved to another grade. So that's it, guys. Tell me what you think about the teacher's crate for this month. This is for March of 2018, and this was my absolute favorite teacher's crate. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to record some more videos tonight. So I'll be recording the May box. Have a good day.